He damn near smoked you. We see you on twerk. It's your boy James. Trust the process. I want to just talk about protecting your peace and sometimes it's not easy to protect your peace. Sometimes we have to go through those hard times in order to appreciate the good times. Stop being dirty. It's your boy James with the stop being dirty. Stop eating dirty. Trust the process. Protect your peace. DNA. Angry DNA, why you so mad, Eric? Eric, why you so angry with the hello? <laughs> Yo, DNA really wants this battle. DNA versus Holler the Dawn. I would not be watching this battle. Unfortunately, I want to watch this battle. There's no, I have nothing against this battle except the things that I'm going to tell you that I have against this battle, but not to a point of me not wanting to see the battle. Yo, you know what's so crazy that I got a cold right now talking about the Hollow DNA battle, and I, I sound like Hollow right now. Hollow has like, been having like, Hollow and Swave 7 needs to go see a fucking doctor already. They, they've had colds for like 19 years. But Hollow versus DNA, salute to Hollow to Don. You know what I'm saying? Salute to DNA. Two legends in the game. Love to see it. Queens, New York. You already know what it is. I heard y'all talking about Corona Queens and Hollow talking about uh, 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 I mean, Jamaica Queens, Southern Boulevard, Hillside Ave. I'll at your boy. I am Queens. From Albert's Pizzeria to Hillcrest High School, Long Island City, Steinway, Farmers, Southside, Corona. Been there. Lemon King Ices. Love them. I'm hype. Queens versus Queens, that's fire. I'm hype off of that. The reason why I'm not too hype about the battle, and I had to hype myself, I was just told to surf in the spaces about this, is just that it's just too late for me. Like, I feel like this battle should have been happened if it was ever going to happen, but it's also not a battle I ever thought would happen, so I don't think it should have been happened. I think if it was going to happen, it should have happened. That makes sense? Subscribe to the channel, by the way. Hit that like button, that subscribe button. That dirty notification bell right in the comments. What do y'all think? You know what I'm saying? Just wanted to throw that out there because y'all be watching these boss forgetting to subscribe. Hollow the Dawn! Calm Hollow versus Angry DNA. Might have to put that in the thumbnail. Uh, okay. The real reason why I feel like this battle's happening is all DNA. I feel like DNA is kind of like. <sighs> DNA is like. It's like you date all these women and it's like you 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 you've had these women in your in and out of your life and like they've hurt you 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 have relationships with some some you've hurt them you've been up and down with all these women and this whole time your BFF who who also is an attractive girl but you never really seen that way but she's always been wifey tight she's always looked good she's always had a crush on you She's always been just right there, but instead you're wiping up these thoughts and getting and, and fucking with all these slides, but she's always been right here. That's DNA. DNA is the, it's like the wifey type that ain't been wifed, but yet he's been wifey type this whole time. It's like, DNA's a legend. DNA is fire. DNA is like the, the most unappreciated fire legend though, but he's been fire and legendary this whole time. He can he can he can he can stand with the best of them. He he could have been did this. And I feel like DNA is in a point where he's looking at like a hollow, like in a jealous way, an angry way, in a in a in a hatred of like hollow the dawn is ranked higher than me, but I've done more than him. See, the thing is with that, on paper, maybe that's true. But Hollow's, like, the amount of battles, the work ethic, the consistency, the two-on-two -two tours, and all that shit. Bringing the sponsorship, being in the games as a kid, all things like that. Going from no tooth to a tooth, no tooth to a tooth, no haircut, got a haircut, dirty shirt, clean shirt. He's, he's made all these processes. The problem is, is that Hollow's just been more impactful. 
DNA battles Tay Rock, and Tay Rock's talking about Tadurkin and Danani's Duke. The hollow battles Tay Rock, and you have the seatbelt line that's going down in history as one of the best lines. And that it hollows third round, and you see the difference there? DNA battles Sue Surf. Sue Surf had on like his girlfriend's bubble coat and, and DNA's there and, and it's, it's an old setting and it's a classic setting of battle rap and where they were putting out one round at a time and cool but hollow battle surf and it goes down as one of the most like that battle might have made surf top tier whereas the battle with DNA did nothing for either one of them impactful hollow the dog versus Loaded Lux is one of the greatest battles, debatably the greatest battle ever. I was just debating this online with Greedy Gotti. Salute to him. Very knowledgeable uh, uh, source of, of battle rap. I have A Verb and Holla the Dawn. Uh, excuse me, A Verb and ha uh, Hitman Holla as number one ever battle ever. But I, but that's a close second. He has, we had it like this. I have Hollow versus Lux as number two. Hitman versus Holla, number one, and he has it the other way. Impactful. Holla the Dawn versus Charlie Clips. Legendary. DNA decided to be best friends with Charlie Clips. Neither one of y'all battled Murder Mook. Uh, Holla, uh, DNA and Disaster. D DNA has that over Holla. That's one of the greatest battles ever. DNA and Disaster. I don't like Disaster. Just as a human, I just think he sucks. Like that attitude and the, the death threats on the internet, he's fucking weird. But talent wise, he's incredible. I don't want to be his friend ever. So, in that sense, I like the guy because I don't give a shit about him outside of what he could do. And what he can do talent wise is incredible. One of the greatest battles ever Disaster vs. DNA. Drake there. Like, I, again, we can keep this going and going. The point is, I just feel like Hollow has more. This is how their battle's gonna sound, by the way. You know it's gonna sound this way. It's an ill way to battle. Like two legends talking about their legendary status and comparing it to each other. This is how it's gonna go down. DNA wants to talk to Hollow so bad about what he's done, the ESPN, the, accol the accolades, and things like that. I just feel like DNA is angry because he's coming from, jealous wasn't the right word to use earlier. It was just like, it's almost envious though, but a good envy. It's like, why are you not noticing me? That's why I was making the reference to like, that wifey type that's just been sitting there while you're out here dating everyone, but she's just been there the whole time, just as worthy, but more worthy than all these people you think is worthy. She's as worthy and more, that's DNA. And DNA has to approve to himself. I feel like, because to me, DNA has none to prove. I mean, DNA gave me one of my best battles of my career. DNA versus Jims, the, we had like a thousand people in the room. It was, in, it, I think it was in Boston. One of the best battles of my life where I pulled out all the soap on DNA and he, he rebuttaled it. I mean, go check that battle out. I should put a clip of it here, but I'm not gonna be able to, I ain't doing all that. Go check out. Man. Man, I got some shit. Y'all really don't give a shit about the shit that I've done. I, I really have to accept that. It's like, I really accepted that. Like, it's like, I'm just like this, like, <laughs> why you guys don't realize all this shit I've done in my career? Nobody gives a shit. Just blog. Just blog. Oh, fuck you. You can't erase history. And I've made it plenty of times for me personally. Decade cards and A-verb battles and trolled battles and you. Anyway, it's not about me. Nobody gives a shit. I'll be back soon, though, like it or not. But, uh, I, I mean, a lot of people give a shit. I mean, you know, I'm just talking shit. A lot of people fucks with me, you know what I mean? I feel like I never... Anyway, I'm gonna talk about that in my next battle. Which uh, will happen in 2022, by the way. But as far as DNA and Hollow goes, I feel like this battle, DNA really does want it more. But Hollow don't take battles just to take them. I feel like Hollow speaking about, you're about to see one of the best Hollows ever. He knows he can't mess with DNA. He's very in tune. You never get a slacking Hollow. I didn't like him in math at all, but it's so funny how a guy's been battling over 10 years and you still only have that one battle you can make reference to when it comes to not liking or saying that he got a clear L in. I don't think there's many other ones. Hollow's been around since the Grand Time era, the Smack DVD. I just feel like he's definitely 
one of the greatest ever. Uh, for me, there's a win. It's a win either way. You know what I'm saying? Like as far as uh, well, I beat DNA. So now if Holla beats DNA, and I beat DNA, me and Holla got a battle. It just makes sense. Nah, keep me out of this, man. I'm just a fan of both. A fan of uh, happy to see the battle when I do see it. Like I said, it's dropping on my birthday, February 26th, so I won't be able to actually be in tune with that. I think it's February 26th, right? Is it February 26th? Something like that. And so is the Remy card. Like, why I did that? I, I don't know. Everything with dates be strategic, so I feel like they did that on purpose. I don't know what kind of shit they got going on. They stay doing shit like that. I told Sirius Jones that about Sirius Jones battle. I, I started it like that. You know, Smack uh, did an event on the same day and night. Started as a haymaker. It was the first time Smack did that. That battle with me and Sirius Jones, that event was the first time URL changed their date and made it the same as RBE. That's where the war really started for me. But, um... Yeah, so what y'all think, man? Holla the Don versus DNA. Why do you think the battle's gonna happen? Do you think it makes sense? Do you think it's too late? Do you think it's a perfect timing? Who do you think's gonna win? Let me know. Subscribe to the channel. Trust the process. Protect your peace. Queens all day. Salute to Holla the Don. Salute to DNA. Got all the respect in the world for both those brothers. I respect their, their, their resume, their legendary status. The for DNA giving me that shot that time. Set my career off. Holla the Don, you know, reaching out to me behind the scenes when I had went through some things. He didn't have to do that. So I'll always appreciate him for that. You know what I'm saying? Both of them incredible artists and go in the ring and go kill each other and put on the classic fellas. Stop being dirty.